I mean, that's why we do a lot of paper print. We do blogs, we do all kinds of stuff. We do stories, we write stories about the, the real estate market, about properties, and we submit them to papers, whether they hear, they're they here locally, whether they're from afar. That's part of our marketing plan. That's a lot of things that, those are things that a lot of people don't realize we do. You'll realize it when I sit down with you because I show it to you. People have no idea how much money I spend in marketing. No matter what, good market, bad market, I'm always doing that. I never stop. I never, in a bad market, I don't go, ooh, we gotta pull back. I don't think I've ever pulled back in my marketing. In a bad market, I usually go forward that much more. I usually go, no, we're all in. You know, after the storm, one billboard moves to two billboards. I'm all in. We did that much more advertising. We did that much more direct mail. We did that much more social media. After the storm, we don't follow the herd. We get out front. And especially now in today's market, you have to be out front. You have to be out front in your marketing because people are going to start making some changes and they're going to start saying, you know what? This is a business decision. I'm going to call him. I'm going to call that team. I'm going to call that group because they do it right and they bust their butt. That's what you want. If you're trying to sell your home, if you're trying to buy a home and make a good decision, you want someone who's going to work for you.